everybody, Phil here for AndroidCentral.com, and I want to talk to you for a minute about the home screens on the Samsung Galaxy S class of phones. We've got the Vibrant here. First, you have the lock screen, real easy to use. You just take it and flick it away. If you have uh, any missing phone calls, that's where you'll see them as well as a little missing puzzle piece. But here's what I really want to talk about, the home screens. They're very colorful, and that takes a little getting used to. And otherwise, the home screens are pretty much the same, right? You've got seven. You flip back and forth through them. You can push the little dots up at the top. Down at the bottom, you have a dialer, uh, your contacts, your messages, and your applications. That's how you get to the apps instead of the app drawer. Now, you can't customize those like you can in some other launchers. And that's kind of a shame, especially since you have so much space to do good stuff with. But come to live with it. But here's where it really gets cool, and Samsung's done something neat. Hit the menu button, then you have an edit field, and you tap that, and look at that. You can edit entire home screens at once. Uh, so you get a little minus sign there, you hit it, and the entire home screen disappears. If there's something on it, it warns you first, and that's really nice. So we'll hit OK, and look at that, it's gone. Cool. Now, when you're done editing them, uh, you have the option to either save or discard. So if you don't like your changes, you can hit discard, which we will do here. Okay. And everything's just as it was. Now, watch this. Say you have an entire home screen and you want to move it. Say you don't want it in the fourth position in the middle. I want this one all the way on the left. Tap, hold, and drag it. And <laughs> you've just moved an entire home screen. Change the order. That is a very cool tweak. I know a lot of people have asked about doing that. And say so you're done, hit save, and there it is. It's now in the seventh position. And if you hit the home button, it takes you to whatever is in the fourth. There you go. Very cool tweak from Samsung. I like that a lot. So, Galaxy S. See y'all later.